One of the most important techniques in Photoshop to know is masking. Masking is a way to toggle visibility of pixels in a layer, but it's different and superior to simply erasing. I'll explain. Open masking.psd in Photoshop. This file has two layers. With the top layer selected in the Layers panel, select the Eraser tool and select a soft edge brush. Click and drag in the canvas and it removes pixels. If we wanted these pixels back, we'd need to go to Edit, Undo, or go back in the History panel to a certain number of steps. There's a better way, though, to remove visibility of pixels. Instead of choosing the Eraser tool, navigate to the bottom of the Layers panel. Making sure the top layer is highlighted, click the Add Layer Mask icon on the bottom of the Layers panel. Notice it added a white box next to the layer. This is the layer mask, and by default it's white, so it has no effect on the layer. Choose the Brush tool in the toolbar, and then Click the foreground color and select black. Making sure the layer mask is selected, click and drag in the photo and it will mask out the pixels. Set the foreground color to white and click and drag and it will bring the pixels back. So this is non-destructive editing. If we painted gray in, the pixels would be partially maxed out. Quick tip, press D on the keyboard or click to the left and above the foreground color picker to set the foreground and background to white and black. Then press X on the keyboard to flip them. This is much faster than selecting black and then white on the bottom of the toolbar. Next, we'll create a layer mask from a selection.